guys, welcome back to Tyler Takeover. And today we're playing some more Dark Souls. Now, I did some exploring around Firelink, you know, and it warped around bonfires and yada yada. And then I found, I went to the Valley of Drakes. And then I found this thing. The Red Tearstone Ring. It was actually kind of hard finding it. The ladder was very hard to see, but I got it. And I also died though, that's why I have zero. And then I had to rekindle, and for some reason I have 12 Estus because... Something happened. I don't know. Some orange flame shot into me. So, twice. I don't, I don't know what it means, but yeah. Then I went over here and uh, saw that guy. I haven't gone over there ever since I saw him there. I'm kind of trying to avoid him for the channel, but he looks kind of scary. And really menacing. Is he an enemy? I can talk to him. He looks really gross. Ah, hello. Was it you who rang the bell of awakening? Sure. I am the primordial servant, King Seeker Frant, close friend of the great Lord Wind, chosen undead, who has rung the bell of awakening. I wish to elucidate your fate. And the very His voice even sounds kind of creepy. Head, chosen undead, your fate is to succeed the great Lord Gwyn, so that you okay. may lick the fire, cast away the dark, and undo the curse of the Now, let us take that vessel on a journey. I assume that you are ready. What now? Now, be still. What do you mean, be still? What are you doing to me? Oh my god! Why is he... Ah, uh, he just ate me. How long is that creature? Oh, game over. <laughs> Roll the credits. Oh my god, that is disgusting. Bro, how big are you? Where... Where am I? Firelink altar. Whoa, that's a cool door. What? Aw, but isn't the Lord Vessel the thing that's let me warp? Or can I still warp? Can I open this door? Locked by some contraption. Okay. Dude, this is really weird. Kind of creepy. That thing is gigantic. How did I fit that in my back pocket? Ah, so I can still warp. But am I able to look from every bonfire, or is that just taken away? No Lord Souls to offer. I need 15,000 Souls to level up. Wow, I'm level 50 already. That's crazy. Wait, so I want to test this out. Can I still warp between bonfires? Like every bonfire? Can I still warp, warp from every bonfire? I can. Okay. But what do I do now? Alright, so I looked it up, and uh, there are a few places I can go. One of the places, which is New Londo, apparently, which is literally right under me, is blocked off. I mean, no, I can, I can go to New Londo, but that's meant for later. But I can go to New Londo, go through it, and reach the end of it, but in order to traverse the abyss, I need a ring called the Covenant of Artorius. And I need to... What the heck? And to reach the boss that gives me that item, I need the thing called the Crest of Artorius, which costs 20,000 souls. And Andre sells it. That's the thing that we saw a while ago. Or at least that I saw. I think I cut it out of the video. 
And there are two other places I can go. There's uh, that spot in, or in Orlando. There's this spot in the catacombs. So, I was thinking that the catacombs might be the place I want to go next. Either that or the Orlando spot. But I know how hard in Orlando is. Well, now I gotta think. Alright, well, there's a change of plans. I'm gonna actually go back to the catacombs. Because I found out by looking it up again that you get a thing by beating an easy boss called Pinwheel, which everyone knows that Pinwheel is the easiest boss in Dark Souls. But you get the thing called the Rite of Kindling. You know what that does, right? If I kindle two more times than I normally do, I get up to 20 Estus flasks. Now that sounds good. Are you sleeping? Well, luckily I don't need to go down there. I'm probably just... Well, I can't even warp down there. I just realized that. It's kind of weird. Well, the catacombs. Now, I don't know how much damage I do to these skeletons now. But... Boop. One hit, let's go! Easy peasy, easy game, one hit to kill the skeletons. This is gonna be the easiest area I've done in my entire life. Boop! I already hated the original catacom or Catacombs of Carthus in Dark Souls 3, so I have no idea how this is gonna go. I already know that the, that the one in Dark Souls 3 was horrible, so... I don't know if this is gonna be any better. Or any worse. Oh, it takes an extra hit to kill him when I'm one-handed. Man. Well, whatever. What's down here? Oh, I'm assuming that's how you actually get in the catacombs. Okay. Now, apparently I didn't explore everything. Like, I didn't get every item. I just got the... Jesus. There's a lot of dudes. Oh, oh, don't fall off and die now. Just because you wanted to look at yourself in the camera female oh my god the lighting changed twice that's scary what what are these okay so they explode it's great to know red floating heads explode Dude, that's a long radius that's a huge huge blast radius why is that such a big blast radius I'm not going down there I'm probably gonna die okay what okay hang on is this gonna be worse than the catacombs of Carthus is this gonna be worse than blight town boop is this gonna be worse than Sen's Fortress? Ho! Oh, what? I just said like three different areas in a very short time span. Boop. Boop. Woo! Easy shmoney. Oh, you can't backstab him. That's kind of disappointing. Wait, can I parry? Can I parry you? Oh, you just came back to life! Ain't that fun and dandy, you stupid idiots. Get ready to die again because of your lord has sinned against mine. Okay, these guys aren't dying. They keep on coming back. So I think I gotta get out of here. Because they aren't dying. And that's not a good sign. Because they're gonna keep on chasing me. Um. What? Hang on. Uh, where do I go? Huh? Is this a breakable wall? No. Um. This isn't good. I'm gonna die. Attack! Where do I go? 
Oh, are you kidding me? That's sneaky. <gasps> yes. What? Oh, great. Ah. Oh. Okay, so, so long as I can just kill these guys, or have the illusion that I've killed them- OH MY GOD! Light it! Rest. 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 Oh my god. I- I need a Kindle again? Dude. Why is that happening every single time now? Does that happen when you're human? Is that what happens when you're human? Is that... A thing also... Oh, okay. I was about to say, where do I even go at this point? That sucked! Just to be... Oh, that's pretty. Wow, that's that's really pretty, okay. Hey, buddy. Go around and... Boop! Backstab! I ain't gonna let you get away. Notice that the other one didn't respawn after I killed him. Which means... That they're really annoying. <gasps> what was that bullcrap? I can't even go over there. Hey! Oh. Jerks. Get hit! That's not fair. <gasps> wow! Okay. That's your trick, huh? From software. Ha! Maybe I shouldn't be in this area. Maybe I should go back to that other spot. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I, I don't know if I'm ready for this. Come on! Start your little explosion! Yeah. That is a gigantic blast radius. Hey, buddy. Let's not make the same mistake I made earlier. Because I have 10,000 souls just chilling here. Ah, he's not dead. He didn't give me any souls. Woo! Run by! Trap ahead. Yeah, I see it. Come here. Spooky, scary skeleton. How did that miss? Get that trash out of here. I feel like that has a way smaller hitbox than what it shows. I don't know if I want to pull that yet. Just give me a second. You love my singing, I know it. Oh my god, where'd you come from? I was just about to put the controller down and go to the bathroom. Glad I didn't. These guys, dude. Why'd you dodge that way? I held backwards. I have backwards. I have video proof. Wow, this... This might be my breaking point with this game. Oh my god, that was way too many enemies. How can you even think when you have thousands of spooky, scary skeletons surrounding you? Well, this is a good time to go pee. What kind of bullcrap is this game? Hey, buddy. Nope, hit him. There we go. Thank you, poise. Now he's gone forever. I never have to deal with him again. Oh, god, you guys suck. Just stay away. Oh. Well, looks like we're caught at a dead end, ladies and gentlemen. Mostly gentlemen. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Whatever. Okay, so they died. Good. Uh. I forgot that they give you bleed, which isn't good. Wait, so if you kill them enough, do they just die? Yeah, that guy did. Okay, so. I'm assuming if you kill them a certain amount of times, then they actually do die. Or if you disassemble them a certain amount of times, they eventually die. Like this guy. He's gonna respawn. And somehow all of his parts magically reappear from the edge that he just, a lot of his parts fell off of. But whatever. And this is the prime example of Dark Souls bonfire placements. Because in Dark Souls 3, there would be a bonfire right here. Because they have bonfires literally around every corner. I shouldn't say that for Dark Souls 2, and a lot of people do, but... 
Dark Souls 2 is pretty good with their bonfires. What? Really? I gotta say, Dark Souls is Dark Souls 2 is decent with their bonfire placement. It's not like they're around every corner like it is with Dark Souls 3. Hey, that guy died. So do I want to go down or do I want to go this way? I want to go this way! Okay, just in case that was a ledge. <laughs> ah, I know your tricks. Even though it does virtually no damage. But... Same with these guys. But eventually, if they gang up on you, they will kill you. Because they suck. Long, hard popsicles. I totally meant popsicles, guys. Come on. Making my way downtown. Okay, so... <gasps> Dude. That scared me. So now what? What that... What would that do? Can I go down further? I can, but it leads to nowhere. No, it doesn't. I'm not going for it. So, what'd that do? You mind explaining? Ah! Okay, so that's not a way I can go. This leads right to death. Um... This is a way to go. That has a... Fog wall. Wow, I could not think of it. Boop. Okay. Illusory wall. You weren't wrong! How nice of you. I love messages. <gasps> really? They hit a bonfire behind the illusory wall just like they did in uh, the Dark Root Garden. Is it? Is it? Tell me. Done. Well then. I have to kindle again. And guess what? I only have a couple of these. I literally only have... Wait, I didn't need to use that. I just realized. I realized when it was too late. All I had to do... Uh... Now I only have one humanity left. See, I saw this ladder. But didn't know if it was the way to go. But of course it's the way to go. Be wary of miscreant. Where? Please tell me that's it. Yes! Perfection. I didn't know it turned it. I thought it just... Weird. I thought it pulled the spikes down. Okay. No one's gonna hit me off somehow, right? No? Good. Good, good. So traverse the white light, and no boss. All right. It's kind of hoping for the B one. For the... Uh, I honestly hope that it was pinwheel so I can get that Kindle thing. Whatever, you know? Just go through the area. They didn't die. That's fun. Oh, I should have leveled up. Of course it's an illusory wall. All right, well, let's go back this way and murder some cheeks. Some skeleton cheeks, to be exact. I honestly don't know if this is even the way to progress. I <laughs> This game is so confusing. Like, is it this way to progress, or... No, no, no. I'm gonna f I, I can't get back up if I fall down there. So that's not happening. But I can go over here with all these spooky, scary skeletons. Hopefully they die. So this isn't the way to progress, because there is no way to go, and the heads are going to close us in with the Gaston Skeletons! Boop. Well, luckily if I die with only 200 souls, it's not going to matter. Right? Right. God, none of these guys are dying. Well, time to go back. Somehow that head didn't explode. That one did, though. So it is this way you gotta go. Boom. So this is the way to progress? How weird. Why do they hide stuff like that behind an illusory wall? From software, you're the new epitome of evil. Well, I mean, not new. This game came out back in 2011. Hey there, buddy. Smack you around. Easy peasy. What's in here? Dark Moon Seance Ring. What's that? Oh, come on. Boop. And I see the wall right here. 
Now, where do I go? Okay, so... Let's hope they stop following me. Because these guys are a real pain. Uh, is this the way to go? What was... What? Oh! I thought it would toggle a message. There we go. Backy stabber. Baku! Baku stabber! Spongy boo boo! <laughs> That's so funny. Wait, well, I want to see the message. Up. Okay. Well, so either that way or. That way. Wait. So is this way the way to progress? Is that other way just a troll? I don't know. Questioning all of life. Down. I knew it. I knew they were going to say that. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, wait. Do I need a. No. Oh, man. What? Oh. Miracle Tranquil Walk of Peace. Well, I'm not a cleric, so I'm not going to use that, but. I don't. What? That dropped me all the way back here? Oh, that's crazy. Wow. You are the true trolls from software. Wow. They dropped me all the way back. Wait. Where is it? And I fall for it again. Wait, what? But where is this? No! Oh, I was too late. Uh, well, whatever. Whatever that guy dropped is now lost to me until I rest another bonfire. Where is this? Like, where am I? Because I actually don't know. That's another spot I could drop. I'm right next to the waterfall. But I... But... You should have parried me. I'm gonna parry you back. Just be... Just because of that, I want to parry you back. Hey there, buddy! Uh... So luckily that big guy hopefully can't fit through that door. I don't know why I said luckily. I hope he can't, but um... Oh, he can! Somehow. Even though... You're absolutely gigantic. Does he die? Yeah, he dies. He gives you 800 souls, even though he's pretty easy, but whatever. So don't go that way. Go this way. Bro. That's annoying. Okay, so this way? Just looks like another troll. It is. Where am I supposed to go? It's not this way. Yeah, it is. Is it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> this game amazes me. The skeletons are gone for some reason. It's kind of weird. Why are the skeletons gone? Okay, so this is the way to go. I don't know why I got stopped twice there. Wait, what? No. Did I break these? No. Okay. That ghost there scared me. How fun. Message. Left ahead. Okay. Well, what's over here? Did that guy just hop in there? Oh, that's a demon. Nestle in coffin. What does that do? Is it like in Dark Souls 2 and it changes your gender? Okay, so this way then, right? Can I grab this? Yeah, thank you. Okay, so I can go down the ladder, but he said left ahead. So what's over here? Breakable wall? No? Okay. Now, oh, what? No, oh, no. Ooh, yeah. Nice. Can I come over? Can you come over here? Can you do an attack that I can actually parry, please? Because I want to parry you. Okay, can you back up? Can you back up from your friend? Okay, here. Yeah, you backed up. Thank you. Hang on. Oh, that was fast. Jesus. 
Come on. Oh, your friend didn't actually die. That's fun. Can you get out of the stance, please? Okay, forget it. If you guys are just gonna stand there circling me in a parry stance, and I'm gone. Deuces. God. Whoa! I almost fell down there. Try rolling. Right. But where do I go? Like, is that where I'm actually supposed to go, then? Ow. Jerk. I'm gonna go down here! Wait, nope. What about this one? Oh. Hey there! Buddy! Oh, you're scary. Oh, you're scary. Backstab! Boop! Okay, that's a lot of your health, but... At least two guys are here. Oh my god, that was scary. <gasps> Come on! Back up! Mm -mm. I can't move! Okay. Where is the next bonfire? Oh no! Can I get some messages? Just go slow. I hate these guys. I remember them in Dark Souls 3 in the Catacombs of Carthus. <gasps> What's okay? There's a boss. Is it Pinwheel? Oh, it's a boss. Okay. <sighs> Dude, that's such a long run. Well. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go. Oh, God, it's going to be such a long run if I die. Oh, please. Oh. Oh, I almost cracked every finger. Whoa. That skeleton had like a hole in its head. Oh, Pinwheel, you're so disgusting. Ugh. Oh, come on. Ew, don't look at each other. That's creepy. Okay, you have a lot of lanterns. A lot of arms. Whoa. What? I spawned clones. What? Whoa. Let's not die. Now it's a pinwheel. Come on. I see you. Oh, you're not the right one. Darn. You're right here. Boop. Wow, really? <laughs> Four hits is all it takes. The right of kindling. What did he drop me? Mask of the child. What? Whoa, he dropped me other stuff. What else did he drop me? Did he drop me a humanity and a homeward bone, right? Yeah. All right. But he didn't give me a bonfire. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Where do I go now? Uh, hello? Oh man, where's a bonfire? You mind giving me a bonfire? Huh? Okay. So there's a bonfire. Get out of here, please. There's a bonfire. Right. Pretty sure it's right here, isn't it? Is this a spot? I don't remember where that staircase is. Yeah, I think either it's this or it's the, uh, the other one. I think it's the other one. Yeah, because the other one drop off more. No. It could be this one. Wait. Where is this at? Oh, that's right. That's where I did the thing. Hang on, now I gotta look. Please, nothing, kill me. Yep, okay, so this is it. So to drop off, I'm gonna heal full. 
right here. Uh-oh, I missed it. Well, at least I know to walk off more and not just kind of inch off. Okay, 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 okay. There we go. Okay. Then walk off. He said not to roll off, just walk. Now this is the bigger drop. Ooh. And there we go. <laughs> there we go. Ah, oh, sweet baby Jesus. Hey there. I didn't realize there was a cutscene. Uh, that's a cool skeletal beard. Am I going to have to fight you or are you another boss? Hey, man, do your own thing. Be gone with you. Be gone? Hey. Wait, why'd you hit the wall then walk away? Okay, so there should be a bonfire. He's a blacksmith. And there's the bonfire. I knew it. He even said during the video, he's being free. He to me. All right, guys, there's the end of that episode of Dark Souls. If you liked it, punch the like button straight in the face. Leave a comment down below and let us know what you think of Dark Souls. This area sucks, dude. I can't even explain it enough. This area is just garbage. Ah, oh, man, I only have one humanity left. That's so stupid, I can't even kindle. Subscribe if you like our stuff, and click the notification bell so you can see our future videos pop up in that notification box he uses. And until next time, we'll see ya.